morning. Today, using ice muna. Ito, parang labo ng camera. Ayun! I'm starting using ice again. Helping your skin to calm. I used this before. Some of my friends already know that I am using this kind of method. But I stop because of laziness. Today, if you can see, our topic is all about shopping. Thank you for sponsoring this video. Hello, good evening guys. And yeah, I already found the time to shoot this one. And it's already 11.28 p.m. After this, talaga tulugan na. I need to do some skincare muna. No, I will do some skincare while we are talking. I am using again the Vichy set. And I always do eyes every morning. Very helpful talaga sa skin ko kasi nga. Naging calm yung aking skin. And my skin care na lang din ako para isahan. Why I decided to use again Bichet? Kasi gusto ko mag-rejuvenate. Gusto ko magbalat. Kasi nagkakaklag pores ako. Tapos yung itim na itim. Hindi siya makalabas. For anything else, I am not a kind of person na impulsive buyer. Pareho kami ni Francis. So, parang nakakatulong talaga yung lightning. Nakakadagdag ng kaganda. Charot. Because right now, I am using one of the item na i-introduce ko sa inyo. Na, na nabili ko. Hindi na magtunong magpagal. Na nabili ko from Shopee din. Where's the remote? There's a little remote. This one. And portable siya. Nilagay ko yung isa dito sa harapan ko. I will turn off. See? Diba? Hindi ako ganun kakita. Nakikita naman. Pero, na, diba? Nabawas niyo yung kagandahan ko. I will turn on. So easy. Tapos meron, naglagay din ako dito sa top ko. Para hindi naman siya ganun. Pero mapag... Diba? Maganda dalawa. Pwede rin tatlo. Kasi dalawa pa lang siya. <laughs> Gusto ko siya kasi nga, madadala ko siya kahit saan. And rechargeable siya. So, kung mag-brand out man, meron kang extra ilaw. Marami-rami ako nabili sa aming kitchen. So, first is yung initan ng tubig. I also buy the same store, yung multi-cooker namin. I am looking for a rice cooker, but I saw this one. I thought it's big, but still usable, di ba? I can do everything. Nakapag-prito ako, gusto ko mag-shabu-shabu dyan. Small portion lang, it's easy to clean. Hindi ko na kailangan ng maraming preparation pa dyan. Ang di ko lang sa kanya gusto, hindi pala siya natatanggal. Yung, di ba, yung normal rice cooker, you can remove yung pinagsasaingan mo. This one, you need to extra careful kasi hindi siya natatanggal. Hindi mo pwedeng basahin yung outside niya. Kasi nga, may saksakan siya, tas may button siya doon, ba? Diba? I am so happy that almost mag-one year na rin yung item sa akin. So, yeah! Meron lang siya mga dents na inside dahil overuse na rin. I think it's still okay. Kadens siya kasi overuse. Masisira man siya kasi you are using it. Kesa naman, nakatago. And then, nasisira kasi na sobrang tago. Next item, yung mga paminta. Actually, dahil may pagkakuripot nga ako. Kahit si Francis may pagkakuripot. So, wait lang. Parang same pa rin. You can use recycle bottle. But because, <laughs> yung gusto ko kasi yung parang medyo maganda sa mata. Pag tinan mo, okay, pantay-pantay, iisa lang sizes. I decided to buy this stuff online. Maybe you're wondering why I decided to buy Shopee. Why not sa mall or sa other store, di ba? Yung mga physical store. Kasi nga, sa ngayon, ang dami-dami mga nanlolo ko online, di ba? Of course, before we bought online, just make sure yung credibility nung bibilhan mo. Yung ratings, yung comments, sobrang helpful niya before you click the button buy button. Ganon. Next, same ng toyo at suka. Gusto, gusto ko siya. Kasi ang ganda lang tingnan. Hindi lang dahil at least organized. Mas masarap gumalaw sa isang lugar na malinis at organized yung mga bagay-bagay kesa sa magulo. Next, this is so, so, so very helpful for me. Yung oil dispenser. Siyempre naman, kung nagluto ko lang ng itlog, di ba? Or nagprito ka lang naman dyan, sandaling-sandali lang. Sayang yung mantika. 
instead na itapon mo, you can use it naman. As long as hindi naman brownie yung mantika mo or super clear pa siya, you can use it. Actually nga, dalawa siya because we don't have enough space pa for the things. So, I decided to buy at least one. Next, yung Samgyup Grill Set. Isa siya sa mga paborito ko din na bili ko. If I remember correctly, it's around 700 plus. Parang nagmahal nga siya eh. Next, air cooler. Actually, we bought the air cooler nung nasa Antipolo pa kami kasi sobrang init. And then when I'm editing, hindi ako makapag-edit kasi sobrang init. Hindi na mas pag-iinarte. Iba talaga yung init ngayon kesa dati, di ba? So, very helpful yung air cooler. Yung disadvantage niya is takaw space siya kasi ang laki. Almost one year na ata namin tong ginagamit. Sa katagalan niya, dahil maalikabok, nagtatapon yung water niya every time we use yung air cooler niya. In terms naman sa kuryente, mas mababa yung consume niya sa normal na fan because I think this air cooler is around 60 watts only and yung normal fan is 100 watts per hour. If I'm correct, I think we bought it around 3K, 4K. Anyway, I will leave all the links below the description box so yeah, you can check it. And all the details will be written on your screen. Next, yung aming ilaw sa labas. Hindi pa siya actually ayos kasi di mo makikita nyo yung may war pa siya. Our house is still ongoing for renovation. That's why hindi pa namin tapos din i-share yung bahay. But I really wanted to share with you na talaga din kahit hindi pa siya tapos. At least you will see our house yung improvement niya. Little by little. Huwag natin bilain. <laughs> Kasi baka ma-short. Next, yung ilaw namin sa sala. I really love yung ilaw namin sa sala. Multicolor siya. The same with this portable ilaw na ginagamit namin. If you want like a cozy vibe, gamit ka ng mga pagka-warm light. And then yung natural light, yung cool light. Pakita ko sa inyo. Okay, this light is yung normal light na ginagamit natin for everyday use. So, next is the warm light. Oh, so, ito na yun. So, parang good siya for vlogging. Na Nag-combine na yung cool light and then yung warm light. So, nagbibigay din siya ng magandang effect. Diba sa camera? You see the difference? Balik natin sa warm. Next, exhaust fan. Actually, we try go to Wilcon. Mas expensive siya na onte, but we decided to buy it sa Shopee. Siguro mas cheaper siya kahit with delivery fee. So, we bought it. Till now, it's working. It's almost one year na rin, di ba? Kasi mag one year na rin kami dito. Next is ring light. Yung ring light naman, ang tagal-tagal ko na rin nabili yan online. Till now, is super useful kasi nga nagagamit namin siya nung nagsamgip kami sa labas kasi wala pa kaming proper lightning sa labas. So, ang dilim. I just remember na meron pala akong ganito. And then, yun. Parang nagkukutom ako. <laughs> Next, yung tumbler ko. The tumbler that I always use. Talagang na-pre-preserve niya yung lamig. You can bought it sa mall or sa other store. Yung mga physical store. But, it's really expensive. Dahil, we cannot afford that. So, I'm so thankful na sa shopping merong doon and it's very affordable at kayang-kaya ng bulsa natin next, camera stand na ginagamit ko ngayon so yung camera stand na to actually to ng mother ko, actually nung kapatid ko pala nagustuhan nga ng mother ko yung ring light ko and then yung ring light na nabili nila may stand na so dahil hindi naman daw kailangan ni mother so they gave it to me yes, thank you so, it's very very useful for me syempre nag-vlog tayo so, ito is free <laughs> so thank you Next is yung microphone. So, I'm using the microphone, the Boya microphone. And I bought it from 800 pesos. Kasi nga, di ba, ako narinig na maayos. Kahit ako din, napuro frustrate din ako every time I edit. You cannot hear me properly. Let me shh, 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 ganun, ganun. And lastly is this blinds. Nasa harapan ko ngayon. We have two blinds lang dito sa aming kwarto and then doon sa sala. It's so useful kasi nga tamad ako maglaba. <laughs> and ayoko rin yung masyadong papalit-palit. So, parang punas-punas lang siya pag pag pag, -pag ganun. Ang ganda lang din. Mm. Yan yung mga nabili ko at nabili namin sa Shopee. We have a lot of stuff din na binili sa Shopee pero tinabad na akong hanapin yung iba. <laughs>
to. Maybe I will share it to you next time. Pag naalala ko. Medyo inaantok na rin kasi ako. But I really, really wanted to share with you. Why? Because some the people na nag, nakabisit na sa house namin is sobrang na-appreciate nila yung bahay namin. Kahit malit lang yung bahay, I am trying my best na makompleto yung mga items na nandito. So, lahat ng hinahanap mo, andito na. And also, like what I said, me and Francis, we are not impulsive buyer. Every time we want to buy something, pinag-uusapan talaga namin yun. And then, like, I am putting that on our want list. We will stay that that item on that list. Kung hindi namin siya kailangan, doon lang siya. Pero kung kailangan, kailangan talaga namin siya, talagang ora-orada, like, next week, bih na agad. Kasi sobrang kailangan namin siya. So, ganun kami bumili ng item. So, hindi agad-agad. And of course, dahil nga maliit lang yung aming bahay, this is a container house. Yes, we are living in a container house in the Philippines! Per one item lang ang kailangan namin dito. So, if we want a new item, we will change it. So, what I am thinking, if so ko talagang magpalit ng new item, I will try to resell yung item kung usable pa naman. Or, ibigay ko dun sa may kailangan. Kasi sayang naman. And yeah, kasi waste of money rin kasi kung bili ka ng bili, tapos i-stack mo lang sa bahay mo. And yes, we have this kind of culture kasi. Kasi yung mahama ko. Ang dami yung tinatagong mga gamit-gamit. So ngayon, ang dami-dami gamit namin sa bahay. Me and Francis decided na mag, pag nagkabahay kami, we don't want na maraming gamit. What we want is like malakondo style lang. Kung ano lang yung kailangan mo, yun lang. Before I forget to my skincare, this is the last step. Yes, tapos tayo sa mga shiner kong items and tapos tayo sa ating skincare routine. I want to end this video for saying thank you for mommy and daddy, my parents ni Francis because actually this place is sa kanila. They give us space for us to build our house. Ito yung container. And this is not a totally container. This is part from their truck. Their truck is like a close band truck. They decide to make it drop side na lang. So, yung tinanggalan nila is ito na. Dati tong bodega and then pinaupahan nila. And at the same time is they decided na. Actually, Francis asked, we can make it as, as a house. Pumayag sila. So, yeah, we're living here. Mm. Thank you so much po, mommy and daddy. We are grateful and happy. We are still planning to have our home pa din. We are working hard to make it happen. Uh, to have our own place and our own home. For now, let's enjoy this sweet little home. Actually, we really want the same thing pa din. Yung gantong home pa din. Kasi you don't need a big house. Maraming nagsabi it's too small. But... Para sa akin, it's too big na rin. Kasi dalo pa lang naman kami. So, if ever na madagdagan na, di ba? Of course, you are planning to make it big. Or you have another option kung paano yun. Of course, you want a better life for your kids. But for now, because wala pa naman, so yeah, we are happy to live here in the container house. Parang ang ganda din naman kasi na you are living with this type of container house and at the same time, you have more space outside na mas makapaglaro kayo. Diba? Mag-garden-garden kayo if you want. Katulad nito, nag-put up kami ng mga swimming pool outside tapos diligpit lang din. Parang maganda siya, diba? Maras <laughs> marami ka magagawa. So, we are happy kasi this is much better than to rent kasi mas mahal pa rin yung mag-rent. We are happy and we are blessed to have all those people around us na helping us to be independent. We are so grateful and happy. Thank you so much, family and friends who always support us, diba? So that is for now and I'm so happy to share this with you guys, our milestone to have our home, sweet home. See you next week. Bye. God bless.